I feel like my skin feels soft, it feels bright, fresh, and ready to tackle the day. Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Karen Seurat, and I have my awesome husband here next to me, Nishal. I like to say we met at the library. Karen always says we met at a party, but either way, it's history now. And uh, we got married in 2002. Nishal is very calm. Nishal is very down to earth. He's just the right person for me. He just resets me in a very good way. She is a little intense, and uh, I kind of like that. You know, it keeps our lives moving forward. For the longest time, I'd just get a bar of soap, any soap, which I had laying around and wash my face with it. Now it's a little bit more complicated than that, but I wouldn't say complicated at all. If I give him a skincare regimen that has 10 steps to it, there's no way that's happening. I feel like my skin is a little rougher in places and I, ha I do have a few wrinkles. He wants to look younger, he wants to look fresher, but he's okay with some of the fine lines that are there. I'm going to be picking a chemical peel for him that's kind of more geared towards his sensitive skin. We're doing the micro peel specifically designed for the sensitive skin. People won't notice, or if they do notice, they'll think you got a mild sunburn. That's the extent of what it should be. It's actually going to be pretty quick, and that's why I like it. Really, you can be in and out in 30 minutes. If you're going to embark on these procedures, just make sure you have also a good at-home skincare regimen. After you have your peel, there'll be a couple of products that I'm going to show you that we actually have at our house. Once the glycolic ten renew overnight, I like that post peel. I think that's going to be really good for your skin. The first part of it is actually cleaning off your skin, so making sure we get out any residues, any oils, any sunscreen. We're going to put some goggles on here to not only protect his eyes, but also protect the skin around his eyes. So there's different types of ingredients in the chemical peels. This one has more lactic acid in it, so it's not going to be as strong as some of the other acids that we use for some of the other chemical peels. So you might have a little bit of burning, but for the most part, you shouldn't feel much. So we can see here where initial skin is getting a little bit pink, kind of in the middle parts of his cheeks. That's exactly what we expect for this type of peel. No irritation. Good. I'm just roughing up a little bit of the peel, and I'm going to do a second pass to make sure that everything's been taken care of. So now we've gotten the peel off. How are you feeling? My skin feels very moisturized, actually. Within a few days, you might have a little bit of mild sloughing of the skin, but it shouldn't keep you from doing the things that you're normally doing. Typically, you might feel a little bit of tightness for the next two days, but you'll see at the end of the week where you'll have a nice glow, and you can start the glycolic tent tonight and actually be okay with that. One of my favorite products is probably the Levon Glycolic 10, which I have a lot of my patients do after chemical peels. You only need a small amount for your entire face. It is a little bit more of a lotion base, but you don't want to overdo it. Glycolic 10 is the perfect way to maintain the glow without having the peeling. It addresses discoloration. It addresses fine lines. It's really good to help you achieve the result that you're hoping for. Initial reaction, I mean, I feel like my skin feels very soft and it uh, looks a little brighter than you know it usually does this time in the morning. Everything feels good, there's no irritation, which I was afraid of. I really like this procedure so far, and I'm excited about the results. Last night, I used the Glycolic 10, and I can see why it's the perfect complement. I haven't had any issues at all. It's been really good. I feel like my skin feels soft, feels bright. Feels like it's just kind of overall balanced my skin tone. I feel like I wake up and my skin feels fresh, and ready to tackle the day. I'm Dr. Karen Sarah. I strongly encourage if you have any questions to go see your dermatologist so we can pair you up with the right skincare routine. Thanks for watching.